What's up, guys? Chips A Vlogs with another video. This is Gwen. And Barrett. And this is a video on how to mod the retaliator barrel to look like a sniper barrel. Yeah, kind of. Um, right now, Joyce is kind of working on my two speakers. I don't know what happened to them, but we'll, we'll this see. This one plays sound anymore. Yeah, we'll see. Well, they do. It's just like It's not. really So, quiet. let's get with the mod. So, yeah. Unscrew. So, oh, no, it's fine. Okay, so, unscrew all the screws as usual, so we'll take out these pieces, like so. And when you open this up, watch out for this little piece here, these tack rails. Those are part of your tack rails, so. And so, the other piece of the case right now. Let's put it aside for mm -hmm. a minute. So, what we have here is the tube that would be inside of here really when the just... dart fires through. Just this, let's so, see. So, it, it's usually like in, like yeah. in place? Or... It's usually in about... It's usually like in place something like that. Yeah, right there. It's usually in place just like that. Mm -hmm. So, what do you do? So, you take there's, it out. You can kind of see that this side is shorter than this side. So, what you would do is... Instead of placing it in a little notch right here, here, you would move the bond side up one more. So now that's this, like this thing that's here, it's in this hole right there. Mm -hmm. So then you just basically like put everything and back together. With this, this is the dot I was talking about earlier. <coughs> you would just unscrew this screw, and there would be another screw up here take the thing apart like that and then you could easily very easily take this part and out flip upside and then that's how the dot would work for this most people probably wouldn't like it but i kind of do and that would go back right there when you're done you would carefully put this you would carefully put this over like that, and then once it's in place, it'll look like this. And so you take your barrel parts and carefully place your barrel parts over like this. So it looks something like this. When you squeeze the barrel together, it won't go in all the way, but it, it still looks really nice. So you tighten these up. So, and then this is what your barrel would look like, and then you could use it on any ice strike attachment, like the retaliator. Um, that's the mod for the barrel. Onto the retaliator. I'm not going to unscrew this one because it'll kind of take a long time, so I'll tell you the locations of the screws. So, we have four screws on the trigger handle. One screw here, another screw here, two screws up top, two here, two at the back if you want to complete the mod this has to be done, and a screw there. But then, you're going to have to do this because there's two more screws there. And so, you would open it up, and right here is the clip release, right below there is a white lock for the trigger release and a white lock above it for the trigger restrictor. So you take those out and you won't need them and just put your glass together and your mod would be done for your retaliator. So this is JPJ Vlogs. Here we have Gwen, Barrett, and Julius. And see you in the next vid.